Hey, it's Jeff here, your YouTube reviewer of New England Brews, and welcome to NEBR, New England Beer Reviews. Introducing to my viewers another brewery that opened in New Hampshire over the summer of 2015, the Swift Current Brewery of Manchester, New Hampshire, and this is one of their three early offerings. It is called the River Runs Rye, with an alcohol by volume of 6.5% ABV. Swift Current Brewing sort of made themselves known publicly at a brew fest, the one I did a report on about a month or so ago. And they're located in Manchester now. They're, right now they're sharing equipment with another local brewery. Eventually I think they want to open their own uh, brewery where they can actually use all their own equipment. But this is the way it is now. So I'm going to get right into this, this uh, beer and check it right out while I'm standing along the river. Seems appropriate for River Runs Rye. So give it a pour into this little, I think it's about an eight ounce or so glass. It's a good traveling glass, one I like to bring with me out on these little trips and, and forays out into the wilderness when I do these reviews. So there you go. Gives me a good chance to really sample things, plus a decent amount of pour. That one poured pretty good. So that one did pour pretty good. And you can see it is, uh, I'd say, a medium kind of caramel colored medium amber uh, with a pretty decent soft uh, fluffy head up top here off-white sort of cream colored but uh, otherwise about a medium amber uh, maybe a hint of cloudiness in here so checking out the aroma I'm picking up some of those rye grains and I'm picking up kind of a neat spicy hot character the nah, they talk about citrus on their website but I have to think about that. I am definitely picking up a spicy character, though. Uh, and a kind of a nice uh, roasted malt and roasted rye grain character. Check out the taste. Mm, definitely a nice bitter end on that. But as to uh, the uh, body on this, light to medium. Mm, really easy drinking. Light to medium. And um, then there has the same thing. I'm picking up that rye grain character at first. And there's a bit of a more hoppy bitterness coming up at the end. A dry, sort of spicy hoppy bitterness at the end of this. Mm. Lingers on at the end pretty well. It's got a nice lingering character to it. And at the same time, it's forwardly sweet. So I'm getting a really nice caramel toffee sweetness with those rye grains. Now, in the taste, definitely a sweet character at first, but not overly so. But a nice sweet beginning, which leads to a bitter end. Hmm. That sounds like a romance novel. A sweet beginning to a bitter end. But that's also the way you describe a good beer, a good balanced beer, in my opinion. <laughs> hmm. Easy drinking beer. Uh, quite easy to drink this down. Um, it's... I like that bitterness at the end though. It's definitely a good spicy bitterness that kicks in at the end of this beer. So um, it's a nice impressive start for this uh, new brewery. I think I tried out some of their beers but didn't talk about them. I might have even tried this one. I'm trying to remember. But I know I tried out at least one of the Swiftwater uh, brews when I was at the Brewfest in Manchester, New Hampshire about a month or so ago. I did a report on that. If you look back on my channel, you'll find that it was the Grand State Brewers Festival, uh, end of July, I believe it was. So, so uh, and they were there. That was the first time they'd sort of shown themselves to everybody. So, um, anyway, but this is a pretty good start, a good beginning for this brewery. They've got two more beers that are listed on their website. Haven't seen them yet, or they may not be in bottles. This is the only one I've seen in a bottle. They may only have those available uh, in growler form or something like that, but for the moment, this is the one in bottle and uh, a bomber bottle at that. And it's a pretty good one too. It's I like that. I really like that spicy bitterness at the end. I mean, I'm, that's kind of what I'm coming away with on this beer: spice, sweetness to start, and a spicy bitterness to end. So that's it for now. This is Swift Current Brewing, and this is their River Runs Rye. Thanks for stopping by. I'll catch you again next time.